Hey everyone, this is Arthur Lisiaga with Good Times Radio TV. We're here at the 2013 Chicago Auto Show. We're just at the Auto Week Roundtable. Uh, why doesn't everybody go around just to say your name and uh, what company you guys are? Hi, I'm Dutch Mandel, uh, Associate Publisher and Editorial Director of Auto Week Media Group. Scott Monte, Global Head of Social Media for Ford Motor Company. Simon Sproul, Global Head of Communications and Marketing for Nissan Motor Company. Uh, Jeff Moranis with Cloud Car out of California. Something I found interesting uh, in branding is uh, music. I guess, what is a good sort of genre or just music to put with the start of the brain? Wow. Um, Pink Floyd. Done. Pink Floyd. Next question. Beatles. Yeah. Grateful Dead. Okay. And like, is there like a uh, certain... Duran Duran. <laughs> Duran Duran. <laughs> I, was, I thought you were going to say men without hats. He is a man without hat. Well, I saw that certain companies, you know, they'll like, they'll, they might promote like a certain music group or sort of take that aspect, aspect um, into marketing and everything. I guess, how do you guys feel about that, about, you know, branding with, I guess, sort of like a musical group or something like that? Well, I, I, you know, there are a lot of people who recognize music um, in, uh, in the general media. I'm not one of those people, unfortunately, but I've not been uh, trained to. I think it's a different generation that really appreciates it, and that's why a younger audience, I think, when you can get a, uh, a group that is not well known but can uh, engage them, one, it's less expensive for the manufacturer, uh, but uh, I think that it has a potential for real growth. Well, you know, uh, Dutch here will be the first one to tell you that uh, music doesn't work in print. Um, it's very difficult. Beyond that, uh, we've had a lot of experience with American Idol. Uh, as, as uh, you know, one of the sponsors from uh, the first season, and, and still today, and to us, you know, this is a cultural touch point. Um, a lot of people may not be familiar, obviously, with the new and upcoming artists, but they're familiar with some of the music uh, that they that they're asked to uh, perform. Certainly, the styles, and we have touch points along the way, and we do music videos on every single season where we integrate the product into the show itself. Um, it's a little more difficult than you know Coca-Cola, which is in front of Simon, or AT&T, which is the uh, the network you use to text your uh, your uh, selection. But for us, being part of that musical experience has been absolutely uh, important to us in our, our uh, collaboration with American Idol. You have the song of F1 cars, right? Yeah, no, we're, we're all Gangnam style in uh, Japan. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, no, look, I mean, mu mu music is probably one of those uh, areas that unites everyone around the world, right? I mean, now, uh, joking aside, Gangnam style, I believe, is now the world's number one viewed video on YouTube, right? Absolutely. Yeah. And, and, and what I understand about K-pop is it's 20 years in the making as a very distinct brand yep. and was developed. And Gangnam Style, although we kind of laugh and joke about it, was part is, is one part of a very well executed strategy to get, Kore more to get Korean culture, <laughs> soap operas, products, etc. There is more coming. Yeah. Um, and we see, it, and we, see, we see it in Japan. That in, the, in Japan, K-pop, as it's called, is incredibly popular in, in, in Japan. And in Korea, J-pop is incredibly popular in Korea. So music is uh, is hugely powerful. Yeah, I think the trick with music is you got to make sure that you're keeping it in that primary role of ambassador to your brand. It can do some introduction and some kind of inviting, but you know the brand story should be told by the car companies, and you shouldn't kind of have to make your brand dependent on things that aren't as permanent as the brand. Ford's over a hundred years old. It's tough to find something that's now that can tell their story. You can borrow now to do some introductions and kind of find those matched interests and kind of leverage it really well. But you always want to make sure, you know, your brand has one spokesperson and that's somebody that's a part of that brand. Yeah, well, I mean, we, we, we uh, music's a very emotional uh, touch point for a lot of people. So we had a lot of fun at Detroit, if you remember, with smell. Yes, you did. Switching across to a different emotion. Yeah. So we experimented with the smell for the first time because we went out and we were looking at Shangri-La Sh 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 hotels, <laughs> Abercrombie and Fitch. So wherever you go in the world, a lot of brands now have the same smell. Yeah. So we said, well, why don't we try this at auto shows? And, you know, a few people had some fun with it. But actually, we're going to continue now. And at all the major motor shows around the world will be the same smell. Fantastic. It's Good. an emotional touch point. I mean, we, we, you're looking at all these different ways in which to connect people to your brand. Yeah. Well, and, uh, you know, music, I think, is a lot like humor. Um, everybody's got or thinks they have a sense of humor. Everybody likes music. Um, but 
if you take a piece of music or you take a joke, it's not going to go over well with certain segments of the population. That's just a matter of fact. Right? So you have to find, like Gangnam Style, what's the most universal? Right? What's the way we can touch the most people? And then if you're looking to drive down a vertical or looking to specifically reach a particular demographic, then you know exactly what you have to do to get there. The big secret is the British don't like Benny Hill. <laughs> export the hell out of Benny Hill, and that's all that counts, right? Now, if Benny Hill were on top here, yeah. well, that would be another story. Exactly. Americans only Jeremy Clarkson. Yes. <laughs> Fantastic, interesting. Well, thanks Wonderful. again. Thank yeah, you. Thanks Appreciate you it. Guys. All right. Good. Take care. Okay. Arthur Luciago with Good Times Radio TV. And uh, stay tuned. More to come. Tomorrowsalliance.com. Okay. Great. Nicely done.